Today we bring you the heartbreaking news of one of your favorite soap stars. Eric Braden, who has been on The Young and The Restless for four whole decades, just shared that he is suffering from a major health problem. Make sure you watch the video till the end for Eric's health updates. Hey everyone, welcome to Trend Street. The 82-year-old soap icon, Eric Braden, famously recognized as the Victor Newman has been around The Young and The Restless since 1980, appearing in almost 4,000 episodes. He has been a fan favorite since day one and no one can say otherwise. Some might even say he is the brand for The Young and The Restless. The fans adore him and that's why they all are worried about his health. Earlier this year, Eric revealed that he had a major knee replacement surgery which was a success, but soon after three months, he found out that he had a prostate tumor. Everyone was worried but thanks to an amazing surgeon it all went perfectly fine. And since then he has been in a recovery phase taking things slow. But in a recent Facebook Live, Eric shared some heartbreaking health updates. He shared that his knee surgery had kept him from exercising and working out. If you don't know Eric, although he is already above 80, he has always loved working out, especially boxing. His surgery has kept him away from any kind of sports activities. In fact, he tried doing squats right after the surgery, but quickly realized it was a bad idea. He thought he messed up his knee, but luckily he hadn't, so he took it easy and let himself heal. Turns out he was also suffering from some other health issues. In his Facebook Live, he opened up about his health, because it could be good for some older guys who may, or may not, listen to this. Looks like the veteran star started having problems during his recovery with his prostate, which caused him to wake up every half an hour at night just to urinate. It escalated to the point he just couldn't pee anymore. So he went to a urologist and the problem was solved for a while until he started to feel the same pain and discomfort and could urinate once again. Worried about himself he went to Cedar sinai meeting different urologists to find out what was happening and he did. While inserting Braden's catheter, his urologist shared a story about how he learned English by watching Young and Restless when he moved to the US from Vietnam. However, during the procedure, the urologist discovered that Braden had cancer in his bladder. Nevertheless, the urologist was confident that they could remove cancer and perform surgery, along with a procedure, called Urolift to relieve pressure on the urethra caused by an enlarged prostate. But at a follow-up appointment, Braden was informed that a biopsy showed high-grade cancer cells alongside low-grade ones, which meant that he needed to undergo BCG treatments. Braden has already undergone the initial two BCG treatments, which involved injecting a solution through a catheter to activate the immune system to fight against high-grade cancer cells. He receives this treatment weekly, but the downside is that it comes with flu-like symptoms. Although the timeline is still unclear, from what Brayden said in his vid, he just had his second round of immunotherapy and he's got four more to go. But even cancer can't kill Eric's spirit and that is why we love him even more. He said, I've learned now to listen to my body more and not go all out, adding that he still works out but on a modified basis. So if you've seen me a little under the weather, yeah, I have been, but I will lick this. This bastard ain't going to get me, I'm going to get it. Classic Brayden. That's not all, towards the end, Brayden became emotional and reassured them that he will beat cancer. He expressed his gratitude to his fans for their support and encouraged them to help and support others who are also battling cancer. Let's all join in and wish him good health and a speedy recovery as he continues with his treatments. Let's all chime in sending him nothing but love and support and our wishes for him in the comments below. Thank you for checking this video out. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for new videos every day. Turn that bell notification on if you want to hear from us and comment down below if you've subscribed and we'll make sure to reply and thank as many of you as we possibly can.